This is Taylor with Geeked Out Reviews. I'm doing another review on the Wauoto H1 uh, LED projector. Uh, this is going to be in comparison to the uh, distance from the wall and screen size. So I have the projector sitting here. There's just an Amazon Basic um, tripod. And I have my measuring tape right there. And there's the screen. Um, I'm having a hard time getting the exact angle uh, my, by myself. Uh, so maybe this might be entertaining for you. Who knows? But um, I've had a, quite a few different people ask me for this in particular. Um, so I'm going to try and do this as best I can. So starting from here, this corner, this is set to 100 feet. Come on. And from that, I would probably estimate at 10 foot, it's, pr it's about 100, maybe 11 foot. This is about 11 foot. So now I'm going to change it to 9 foot. Just so you can kind of see it. I'm measuring it exactly as I possibly can, or as best as I possibly can. Uh, this is now from nine feet out. Oh, uh, ignore, sorry about that. My, so I had it at 100. It's definitely not 11 foot. Uh, it would probably be about nine foot, uh, nine to nine and a half foot for 10 foot. not easy to get this stable, so I really apologize for the quality of this video, but I'm trying to help as best I can. Okay. So, at 9 foot, it's exactly at 100 inches. So, for nine feet of uh, of distance on the wall, so you'll get about a hundred inch screen. All right, now I'm going to move it to um, eight foot. Uh, this is the distance that I've I've had quite a few people ask me about. So I'm going to kind of shrink this for now, real quick. From here, come on. All right. So you should expect at eight feet, 90 inch screen. So you should have a 90 inch screen at eight foot. Um, I'm only going to go down to about five foot. Maybe a little shorter. I'm not sure. Um, okay. Now this is at... This is at 7 feet. You're going to get about an 81 inch screen. At six foot. You're gonna get a 70 inch screen. 
It seems like it just keeps going by tens, pretty close to it at least. Um, uh, that's a little crooked. Alright, this is now needs to be, there we go. This is sitting here at six foot. Oh, sorry, five foot. Can't even see it now. That is roughly about a 58 inch screen. And probably the smallest that most people will want it. It's probably going to be about this, which is, of course, four foot away from the wall to get a 46 inch train. Um, so it, it, uh, again, some of the specs are, uh, this is a 720p projector. Um, it will take 4k and 1080p input, uh, but the max output it's going to have is 720p. However, uh, I normally uh, use this outside in um, like where my pool is. I project it on a rear projection screen. People have asked me if it's 4K. Like it, it honestly looks very, very good. Um, a lot of the quality, uh, let me actually bring this back. I'll bring you more of the quality to it. Oh. Hold a moment. Yep, accidentally turned it off. Okay, uh, I, I'm gonna bring you closer to the image so you can see more of the quality of this projector. Uh, let me move it that way. Okay, so way up close, of course, you're gonna be able to see, you're gonna see the pixels. When you're far away, this is what you see you're really not gonna, you're not even gonna notice any of these pixels. Uh, most people are probably gonna sand, uh, let's see, I am about nine foot away from the wall when this thing is sitting at 10 feet. Um, this honestly is a really good distance from the wall, uh, or that was a very good distance from the wall, but uh, I'm, I'm going to focus. Okay, there we go. It's focused. Uh, and you'll see it as I go back. They really come into focus. Like, you'll... You can't... You can barely tell that that is not uh, 1080p. You can barely tell it's not 4K. Like, honestly... Uh, with, with, with this projector, I, this is, I, I've got three projectors that are 720p. This one looks the best. I honestly use this on a daily basis. We watch Game of Thrones, we watch all kinds of different, uh, movies and TV shows on it. Uh, I mean, what, why else wouldn't you? <laughs> Um, we, we have a tiny 32 inch TV in a room and this, this is completely taken the place of it. Uh, we have an, a Ion Outback speaker that we normally, uh, put on it because this has Bluetooth and then you can just project, or you can project and then have the Bluetooth, uh, so you can have a really good speaker on it. The speaker itself on the, uh, on the projector isn't bad, but I would still recommend a, uh, Bluetooth speaker. Um, other than that, uh, my time's running out. This is Taylor with Geeked Out Reviews, uh, and I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching.